G'day Burnout fans, it's Flinty here, down at uh, Pro West High Performance in Maddington. Uh, we've just seen Grant Barnes' awesome uh, HZ on the, uh, the TuneCorp dyno. Uh, car was only just started uh, last week after a uh, full build here down at Pro West. Um, fairly safe tune in it uh, at the moment, just rattled off 1,033 at the hubs, uh, only 6,500 revs, 20 pound of boost, not a lot of timing in it. so. Uh, yeah, safe to say she's uh, it's pretty safe tune in it. So, yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun when uh, when Grant gets in the car and uh, has a bit of a start having a bit of play with it. So, the car itself uh, running a uh, modified HQ chassis, um, originally set up for a lot of the off-road racing back in the 70s and, and 80s. Um, now being modified to obviously uh, get out there and smash some tires. So, uh, running a uh, 406 cube small block Chev, uh, dry sump. Uh, 871, as I said, with 20 pound of boost, uh, a big and ugly hat. Um, that's only been put on there just to get the car running. They're uh, hoping to get a bigger hat on it at some point in time. Um, but at the moment, more than enough. Thousand horse, thousand horsepower at the hubs is. Uh, this thing's just going to destroy tires like not like no tomorrow. So, uh, yeah, two-speed glide underneath it, uh, nine inch, and uh, yeah, things running a uh, full Motec electric uh, dash in it, uh, Maggie. You name it, it's got it. This thing is going to be a handful when uh, when Grant gets in the car and, and starts belting up on it. So uh, good to see another weapon come out of uh, Mark's uh, Mark's shop here at Pro West, and uh, yeah, we've just gassed out the uh, the Tune Corp uh, Dyno all with the uh, uh, with the methanol. This thing's breathing, so it's uh, yeah all good now, and uh, looking forward to seeing this thing hit the pad very shortly. So thanks again, guys, for watching, and uh, yeah, check out these uh, these Dyno passes.